Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I had so much fun on the first video that I thought I would go ahead and make some more. So today I'm going to be planning in my mini and I've done a little pre-planning. Um, you guys are going to have to excuse me. I, I was a little sick and I decided to do a voiceover for this one for the first time. So, you know, trying some new stuff here. Um, here I'm trying to get my little sticky notes off that I do my little pre-planning with. I couldn't get them off with the little wax paper on top, so here we go. There we go. All right, so now I'm just kind of seeing where we're at there, showing you guys a little bit of my ideas, and then I am not really entirely sure why, but I decided to start with the bottom right-hand corner. And I think that may be the reason why is because it says slow Sunday because we have a pretty busy week coming up this week. And I like to put um, events or special things that are happening in boxes to indicate or these little cute little, um, I don't know what those are called, um, with the little flowers on top. They're, not, they're kind of like boxes, but kind of like banner. We'll call it a little banner. How about that? So my daughter has something going on on Friday. And then we've got a couple of things going on on Saturday. So that's why I'm putting that there. And I didn't want to overload this side with a bunch of boxes. So I decided to do something a little bit different this week and mark my kids' practices and things like that throughout the week with mild liners. So I love this sticker right here. Live, lo live life and forget your age. Amen to that. <laughs> so I had to use it. I thought that was pretty cute. And now I think I'm doing my little coffee cup because, yeah, Monday mornings always have to have all the coffee because I stay up late on the weekends. So there you go. <laughs> and then, of course, I needed a little extra floral up in the top to kind of go with the others. I don't, I want to keep everything pretty simple, but still go together. So there we have it. And I'm just, I think I'm trying to trim. Yep, I'm trying to trim my edges of the floral right now off of the page. They're off of the page. And you're getting a nice close up look of my page as I trim. And there we go. All done. <laughs> so yay, I've got the right hand side of my pages done. And now we're going to move on to the left hand side. I am really not going to do a whole ton on this side. Um, a little decorating down at the bottom and just kind of make it flow with the other side. I don't want to go too sticker crazy because I really love this layout and it's so super neutral over here. You don't necessarily have to do a whole ton with it. Although I laid that one down, lining it up at the bottom and notice that it doesn't exactly cover all the way to the top. So I take it off and then I am lining it up with the top so that the little gap is on the bottom and maybe not as noticeable as it was, at least to me, on the top. <laughs> and there we go. Same florals on that side as are on the right-hand page. And now I'm getting my big old sticker that's going to go in the corner. Oh, but first, a little white out because we can't, we can't have words showing through our beautiful florals from the home the homebody mini sticker sticker book. Sorry, I think I failed to show you guys or tell you guys that that's what stickers I'm using here. There we go, my nice big blue floral off of the wax paper. Thank you to according to Allie for the amazing suggestion to use wax paper for pre planning. And there we go. Oops, didn't really want that little guy attached apparently. And just kind of lining it up there just to get a couple more of the little colors together. 
just a touch of floral, not too overboard. And then there was all this space that was there, but I didn't want another quote that was in the box. So I went with a quote, a clear quote, which I love, clear quotes. And I'm having a hard time getting it off the wax paper. And Oh, there we go. There we go. Collect beautiful moments, which is what basically we do all the time in our little plan, you know, planning events and little special things in our lives where we're collecting those moments. All right, now here we go. I am trimming my florals with my little Fisker's finger tip razor blade thing. Uh, fun fact about me, you guys, I am like super nervous and afraid about cutting, like cutting myself. So I don't like knives or razor blades or a lot of that kind of thing. And sometimes I get really anxious when I see some of these other planner videos when people are just willy nilly using their exacto uh, knives all over the place. It just kind of makes me super nervous, but I'm trying to be careful with mine and you can see that I try to put it away a couple of different times but then I realize oh I still need it so then I bring it back in again to to do what I need to do with it it just cracks me up oh there we go putting it away and then I think we're gonna pull the edge of this little floral to try and get it undone but oh wait nope oh it's still attached so here comes the exacto knife again and this time I'm going to free like eyeball it because I got I cut too much off when I was using the um ruler and it finally decides to come off of there. Yay. And I think I was going to trim off the that corner right there, but I thought that it looked really pretty still not so like straight edge so I'm gonna just gonna leave it that way but we can't waste any florals whatsoever so I have to find a place for this little tiny little peach um, flower here and I find a place for it over here in the corner right next to the other blue floral that I have there perfect here we go Okay, so I think, yep, that's it. I'm getting my little case case cover to get put it back in uh, to see what it looks like with the discs. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try this, uh, this YouTube thing out for a little while, and I'll be posting some more videos on here. So if you guys like seeing these little simple little plan with me's, um, hit the subscribe button or give me a little thumbs up here um, just to give me a little encouragement on this new sort of um, venture that um, I'm getting out into. And I just love sharing my passion for my little happy planners and being able to um, share that with all of you guys and just kind of put my creative stuff out there. So yeah, thanks for watching. Have a great day, you guys. Until next time, bye.